continue. Last time on Hyperlight Drifter, yesterday, we finished the western region. We explored, and then we beat the boss. We could go back there and try to clean up that area and get missing secrets. Or we could start a new area. We can go north or east. We cannot go south. I kind of want to start out with, um, exploring. This map is real cool looking. We've got a warp pad. This missing gem. And probably missing money. Oh, and we spent our coins on new abilities, so I need to practice using those. Just the bomb is the new the new thing that I got. And some more health. I wonder, maybe I shouldn't have warped because we probably missed stuff in the very starting areas of this region. I don't know, I guess we'll find out. That is what we're trying to get to, that pink diamond. Yes! Money. It's good that the enemies drop money too. Means that there's more to pick up than just the secrets you find on the map. I've gotten so much more used to the fighting since day one. Day one was so rough. This game is great. I should play it again. I never beat it. It's hard. Showing my partner Steven Universe. Oh no, wait. I got locked in. This room is tough. Okay, let's use our bomb. I love it. Oh, get out of there. I love the music here, too. I'm out of health packs, though. Okay. Uh, Steven Universe for the first time, so hearing you say missing gem just made my mind question what season we're on. We were talking about Steven Universe so much earlier. It's so good. Uh, plus enemies dropping money means a health world economy. I- that's lost on me, I'm so sorry. <laughs> Very not functional. <laughs> Wait, didn't we already get that health pack? Oh, I think I tried to go this way and then maybe died and then we didn't continue this way? Unclear. There's a warp pad here. Weird. Just making an economics joke. I missed it, went whoosh, way over my head. Sometimes, sometimes Saturday morning brain be like that. Any hidden platforms up here? Let's continue. Where does this take us? Up. Good warm up before we go to a new area. Where are we on the map now? 
Is that that one? Is this that cliff that I don't know how to get to? That like elevated region? Oni girl, hi, welcome in. <laughs> Good to see you. Happy weekend. <laughs> oh, the lions don't get me. Don't get me. These lions also remind me of the pink lion in Steven Universe, but they're greed and evil. It's almost like a mix of lion and centipede. Weekend is good. We're doing a Saturday stream today because I'm not streaming tomorrow. I haven't taken a Sunday off in a really long time, it feels like. I feel like I remember walking this way. We did this. Uh, how do I get to that pink thing? <laughs> All right, let's go back. This is a giant area. Wait, is this where we got stuck for a while? I think I'm beginning to get an understanding of this partner thing. <laughs> Perfect use of mallow tag. This, how do I get, is that where I came in? Much confusion. I think now I'm heading out. Yeah, this is the way, this is near the entrance. This is before the music gets all cool. Oh, health pack. These regenerated. That's a good sign. Oh, this is where that key is. We only have one, we need three. Maybe I can't do the rest of this area without more keys. That could be it. I'm pretty sure we went over here too. Yeah, and by we, I mean me, yesterday. Yesterday on Hyperlight Drifter. All right, then I'm satisfied. Good, good warm up exploration. Let's go to a new area. Let's come back here when we have more keys, and maybe when we can climb up. Um. Oh yeah, and this well is here. We can climb up walls. I don't know if we get that ability, but that would be cool if we could climb stuff. Do you all have a favorite, I don't know, region area in this game? Because the first time I played this, I played... We went east first, and that was really hard. And then north was a little bit easier for me. But this, this west, west region is my favorite for sure that I've seen. Okay, let's go home. Boop. Boop. No, it's a trap. 
Oh, and it used one of the other health packs I had. Okay. We can carry four now. Hi, Space Platypus. Welcome in. Had this for years. Never played it. Uh. Oh, I fell off. It's a cool one. I'm playing on easy mode. And I'm not mad about it. Because it's a little tricky. You just have it on your phone, really? That's cool. I don't know how this would play on mobile. I can't see. Oh, I fell off. Why is this- how come I can get to this corner? Humans. Nerd Sloth, There's welcome so in! It was actually the first game I ever won in a giveaway. Oh, cool! And it was too hard for me! It's hard. It's a, tr it's a tough one. On my iPad, uh, it used to be in the Apple Store. I had no idea. Thanks for using those channel points for the Elden Ring challenge. Yes! 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 And thank you yes. for that follow. Thanks, Nerd Sloth. Glad to have you here. We are going to a new area. I finished this part of the map. I don't know how familiar you are with Hyperlight Drifter. Here's our overview map. We did the western region yesterday, so now I'm gonna maybe, maybe try to go east again and see if I can do better than the last time I went over there. It was hard. But we're more powerful now, and I've definitely gotten a better feel for the controls. And we have some upgrades. Still trying to wake up, same. <laughs> Very much same. Thank you again for that raid, I appreciate it. Um, this is the area where we followed the, the dog. I want to know what these enemies are. They look like little spider drones. Have this game in my Steam library and never played it? Installing it right now! Enjoy! Didn't sleep long enough today because we went eating with my mom. Mm-hmm. Up early for a, for a little brunch. Wait, what's on top of that wall? Hmm, actually I don't think it's anything. Oh, these will hurt me. How do I switch? No. I don't remember how to switch uh, guns by pressing B. Okay. Playing Valhalla these days. Oh, that's the one by the same people that made Coffee Talk, right? I need to play that. love pixel games in general. I love pixel art games for streaming because they don't mess up the webcam so bad. <laughs> they don't require so much graphics card, PC, and bandwidth power, so you don't get a pixely webcam every time something really active is happening on screen. Do I have to- okay. Not a brunch, we went to Asian all-you-can-eat restaurant. Oh, nice. Yes. 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 Coffee Talk was made by a different studio. Oh, okay. I feel like I've heard them compared. Is the soundtrack by the same people, maybe? Thank you for that follow. I appreciate it. Welcome in. Because here's the thing about graphics cards, and I don't I don't know a lot, but I know some things. Um, Twitch limits your streaming bandwidth to six thousand mbips. My favorite acronym abbreviation. So even if you have the best streaming PC in the world, it's not you can't. They have to limit it. You have to share. So, uh, there, there's gonna be limitations on- and, like, people don't watch Twitch in 4K, as far as I know. 
even 1080p is kind of pushing it. If you don't have quality options, people can't watch it. What's up here? Oh, death. We're just exploring. And static, the YouTube video players love static. It just destroys the quality for a few seconds. Yep. <laughs> I honestly don't know since I've only played Valhalla. Oh, okay. I'll have to look into that. I remember people talking about it a lot when I played Coffee Talk. Also, we should play... Isn't there a Coffee Talk Chapter 2 now? We should do that sometime. Do you have this problem when you upload a video to YouTube that at first is only available in 360p and you get anxious if there's going to be more? I, I wait for it to process like when I do YouTube videos they they marinate for a long time before I hit public because it takes a minute to finish processing HD but yeah the the worry that it won't finish HD or um that'll take forever yeah I, I always do them private first and then I let it finish processing and while it's doing that it's doing the auto captions which is so helpful for for long 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 videos there's a sequel in the works okay perfect there's a demo hmm. hi tilted welcome in how's it going it's good to see you This area is very pretty. It reminds me of one of the sections of... Tunic. Here's a friend. This person tells us where the toad boss is. Sad time to my country, but other than that, okay. Uh, I'm doing good. It's just, I'm telling everybody, I'm just waking up. Usually I have to upload right away because I do the dumb thing of recording instead of taking right off Twitch. Oh, yeah. The file size, when I started, when I switched editors to DaVinci Resolve, I was getting huge file size and that was causing problems. I fixed it so I don't get as big of file sizes anymore, but yeah, that that's, that's a problem. Thank you for the follow. I appreciate it. Welcome in. Um, it was wanting to process the videos. Again, I can only stream uh, at 6,000 mbips, but the default for DaVinci Resolve, it wants... Oop, hang on. Ninja stars. Oh, you only have two health. It wants to process them at 80,000 mbips? I'm like, where are you getting all these... <laughs> Where are you getting all these bits? <laughs> Where are you getting all this? These data packets? I didn't stream at this quality. How can you how can you make a video at this quality? And then you end up with a 45 gig video file. You're like, no thank you. I'll pass. 12 days till Slime Ranger 2, I know. I'm excited. I'm so excited. How do I get that? Is there a secret invisible platform over here? I don't know. Nice music, though. Slime Ranger is so good. I can't wait. Thankfully, OBS lets you record and stream at two different qualities. You're right. You're right. You're right. It does. I forgot about that. Look at this statue. Colossal hand with sword. Powerful music. What's this? Looks like it has a little flower on it. Oh, here's a health pack. Dang, what a crime to have come through here before with the volume too low. Oh. 
Sweet. I don't care what's happening. I'm getting Slime Rancher to the day it drops and probably destroying my laptop doing so. Maggie the chickens! <laughs> Reunited with chickens! Yes! I can't wait. I'm getting it the day it drops too. I've been budgeting for it. Oh no. There's a body in this water. Oh, oh, my character is not doing so good. All the hen hens. Yo, let's do it, Bagus. Meggie. <laughs> Let us know. Oh, is this a core? This is a core. We can take this out of here. That's the first one over here. It got darker. The environmental storytelling in this game is really cool. The game is all pictures, no dialogue, aside from button prompts. And you just have to piece together what's going on. You're dropped into a whole new world. Not in the Ariel, the mermaid sense, but close. Here's the statue from the other side. Epic! Is there a reason why there's no railing here? Nope, there's no invisible platform at the bottom. That would have been cool. Just makes me want to see one of the titans alive. We've only seen them alive in cutscenes. But then it seems like every time we see one, it immediately gets destroyed. It's very mysterious. Warp here anytime using the map. Oh, look at the little tadpoles. Trying to figure out first if I'll be getting a cousin's hand-me-down set up or I'm gonna commit and finally buy parts. Gotcha. Oh, 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 we're uh, having a tough time. Okay. This is all locked. We can go up here. Is this where that otter is? Yeah, this is like the temple. We, l we listened to this story once before. The otters are running away from the lizards. They're getting trapped in nets. They're breaking their chains to escape. Hi. There's an otter like you back in our village. My Amazon wishlist is just PC parts. What kind of a build are you, are you wishlisting? What are you looking at? What kind of specs? This is all blocked off, so I think we have to go this way. Look at this cool waterfall. This, we talked about cool BRB screens. Stream starting soon in Chicory, some really relaxing scenery. This game would work too. Working on translations for Doom 2 mod, need a break to watch this, gotcha. What kind of mod? And you can, you can have your character sit anywhere and take a little rest. Oh, oh no.
Somebody's making a cool noise. We're losing our music. It's a mod where at the beginning of each level you can pick one of three cards with random effects to make your game harder. Oh, interesting. What type of effects? And you're translating it into German. Nice. Oh, we should do... I've been starting up Duolingo again. We should do a language stream sometime. Oh, here's a health pack. I'm full, so let me heal and grab this. I finally figured out that you can turn off notifications on Duolingo. I feel like they say, oh, this app is most effective with the notifications on, but you know how quickly I dropped it the first time I ever downloaded it because it wouldn't leave me alone? And I was just like, no, I don't want you bothering me. Turn off notifications. Whereas now it doesn't bother me every day. So I'm like, oh, I can't forget to do this. This will be fun. This will feel good if I do a quick five minute lesson. What does that say about psychology of phone apps and, and notifications and the... It's not a gotcha game, but something about gaming culture, instant gratification, I don't know. I don't know what's going on with it. Alright, we're back in this plant temple with the really hard enemies. But we're stronger than ever. And we're completely full on health packs. There's two of them over here? I don't know, we'll leave them for later in, ca in case we need them, I guess. All kind of stuff, random earthquakes, giving enemies buffs, added traps to the level, visual effects, or even one that adds a Sharknado, one that adds a Santa, I love it. Oh, was that a health pack too, or was that money? I don't know. That's locked. This is also locked. Oh, there, it didn't trigger the boss yet. These are so hard, but I know better how to fight them now. Yeah, we're masters. Oops, just kidding. Easy. What's up here? This can be opened now. Try to pull up Amazon and my tabs crash. Oh, okay, no worries, yeah. Share them later, share them anytime. So, very much poking at a budget build around 1200 to 1300, okay. Very cool. <gasps> Money! We have two more coins. I don't think, I think the last thing I can buy with more coins is additional ammo. Everything else costs three coins. Back at the village. Oh, too many enemies that way. Does one of these take us to a warp that I can unlock? And we'll pick this up. This does, but it's not open yet. Julie, hi, welcome in. Enjoy that hoodie emote. I'm liking this game so much more than when we started. Are there invisible platforms here? No. This is the fire section though. Ow, ow.
Oh, you have more health than you did in the other area. Oh no, they usually have three, not two. How far does this bomb go? Oh, oh, not far enough. <laughs> But we got him. Let's open this. Yeah! Invisible platforms? No? Nothing? Okay. Whatever you say. Let's go through the flamethrower. I don't think I can make that. Let's go this way. Now we can. Oh, wrong button. Flashing the HUD is not going to help me. Uh, we'll pick this up. Now. I feel like I just need enough health packs to get through this, because... Oh, there, we're getting better at it. So many health packs. Bam. And now we have the warp pad. Or not the warp pad, the elevator. Is it worth it to get that coin? Ow. Wait, how do I... Oh, you have to follow the right path. I feel like you need a different dash ability for this, otherwise it's just insta-death. Because you can't heal while on those. Well, how far back does it take me? It's top-down path of pain, a little bit. This just takes me to where I, yeah, unlocked this door. So not that far back. And we're full health, full med packs. This needs, I swear this needs that other dash thing that I can purchase. I don't think the pink walls are platform. I think I've tried to dash to them before from like the top down. And it's like a wall there. Here, let's try again so that I don't lose all the health for nothing. Like, oh, I can heal on the edge? You can stand on the corner? Oh, well, rip. That's okay, I want to restart. Let's go this way. They're spoiling me with health packs. Good. As they should. Secret passageway? Ah, this room. No. It would be cool if they would catapult off the edge. Oh, that's not what I meant to do! The 
This room is still the worst. More waves. Ugh. And I'm out of health packs already? I'm the worst. No! Oh, and that's closed now. These are closed. This is the worst room in the game. We start with full health, full health packs, and I still can't get through this. Try again. These are fine. I just can't get used to how um, far it dashes or how any of my buttons seem to work. I feel like I'm constantly pressing the wrong thing. I also feel like I have no patience for properly timing dashes. We done? Did we do it? Finally. Goodness. Does this open any of the doors or not yet? It does. This requires one key. We have one of those. Let me through. Oh, that's not a secret up there. It got all quiet. Doesn't it look like there's a platform over here though? <laughs> Because there is. Sneaky. Okay, we got some money. More fire. Why is it so quiet down here? Oh, not anymore. No, oh god, Jen, what are you doing? Oh, I only get one bomb. Where am I? And then it's gone. I don't know how to recharge the bomb. Eyes like an eagle. Oh. I'm terrible at combat, but I can uh, I can spot the platforms, maybe. The secret platforms. Oh. That's not an enemy, that's my friend. That's my helper bot. We got a core! This area was hard. And we had to have a key to come through here. Oh, who are you? 
warp home to change gear? We got a new weapon? Okay. That's neat. <laughs> this is not an enemy that's my friend. It's our little bot companion. I don't know what their name is. I don't know how to do those sections. But we got another coin. We should go back home. Let me look at the map in a second here. Ow. Cut that out. Alright, I think we're safe here. We're really close to the work pad, it looks like. Oh, that was a plastic thing under the desk. Is there another zoom view? No. Looks like a lantern teapot. I don't know what it is. Is it in the menu? No, because we have to go home to switch it out. Duncan, what you doing? Do you hear Duncan meowing? Hi, buddy. You got so many treats today. Oh. I did notice. But I wasn't doing much in game yet, thankfully. Da -da -da. Da -da -da. If we look at the map, I don't know where this is. I'm hesitant to just warp back there if I know it's going to be far away from our current progress. What's up with this? Ow. Oh, I'm on fire. Okay, well. I wish my cat was that chill, but she's only nice to me when mom's around. When it's just me, she's scared. Cats are so particular like that, huh? I don't know why that is. Oh, I can pick these up now. So that we're full on health again. Is this not close to the warp pad? Now I'm just lost. This is where we came in, right? really getting any closer to it. Alright, I don't care then. Let's just go back home. We'll, we'll have to backtrack a bunch, but I want to go see what this thing is that we picked up and go shopping, and then we'll continue through this area. There's no pressure to go at any type of fast pace. And I'm curious, and I want to go shopping. Oh, when we warp home, it restored our health and our ammo and our bomb.
Do you have the teapot now in your store? No. These are sword abilities. These are dash abilities. Maybe go back home, home to the, to the area where we sleep. Does it have anything to do with this room? No. Let's turn the lights back on. We can use these now? Oh, it's a different bot? Whoa, what? I didn't think we had this before. What did I just throw on the ground? Okay, you know I like the gold. Gold everything. Cool. How come we could never use those before? Does the bot- I'll ask safe word question. Does the different bot change anything about the gameplay? Or does it just look different? You don't have to tell me what it changes, but just yes or no, does it change something? Or does is it just aesthetics? That was so fun. Like, I'm hoping this bot will still show us the invisible platforms when they're around. Which shop is this? More bombs. I'm good on bombs. Hi Skane, welcome in. It's an unusually early stream. Usually on Saturdays, if I'm streaming, because it's not, it's not always a guarantee that we stream every Saturday. Um... But if I am, it's usually a bit earlier. It's it, it's definitely not part of the routine. <laughs> How are you? Welcome in. Yeah, it's kind of like B12, huh? I want that dash ability, I think. I don't need to go look at the med pack abilities because I'm pretty sure I just want this. this one. Ta-da! I always wanted to play this, looking forward to chilling and watching. It's surprisingly chill for how combat focused it is. The music and the environment are really well done. It's a very hard game. I'm playing on easy mode. And I say that as somebody who my combat experience in games is like Metroid, Hollow Knight. I was terrible at Tunic. And I play Elden Ring without fighting anything. So. <laughs> but I've had a couple tell me that this is challenging for them too. It just depends. And we're playing on easy mode, which the, the hardest thing is the health packs are scattered so few and far between and easy mode gives you more health packs so more opportunities to heal after you clear a room and stuff like that. Okay, let's go back over here. I was going to take another break, but I think we'll just keep going for a little bit longer.
I feel pretty good. Duncan's doing good. He doesn't need um, lunch yet. He seems pretty content. We're going back underground. us with our yellow. I love it. <gasps> Hi, Jovial. There's so many. Welcome in. Saison, welcome. How are you? Happy weekend, everybody. I don't... Oops. Hang on. <laughs> I don't normally stream on Saturday. We were just talking about that. Sometimes I do, but it's not part of the weekly schedule, and uh, it's been nice been very relaxed chill weekend stream vibes there are so many health packs down here oh we have to clear out these enemies again it resets the whole thing Duncan is clawing the chair I said he was content but he's not content now I was testing out the new dash. It doesn't block you from enemy charges, only from projectiles. Ooh. No, it got me while I was healing. I'm distracted because Duncan's using the scratching post or the chair, buddy. Hi, can I play this game? I made coffee cake, and to fill time, I cut into breadfruit and ended up making hash browns out of it. Oh, nice! That sounds lovely. Duncan says hi. He's been he he's loving all the attention today. He's already gotten two treat sessions on stream. Hi, bud. What you doing? Yeah. We'll see if he settles. More Duncan! He's talkative. You want to see him again? Can I pick you up again or no? Ooh. I said he was content and he immediately threw a fit. Yeah. Finally figured out what the game reminds you of a game called CrossCode. Oh, I have CrossCode on my wish list. It's on sale right now. I think. You're so wiggly. Excuse you. Okay, bye. <laughs> um, I'm gonna go give him... I don't know. Either give him a snack or kick him out. Because he's being fussy. I will be right back. Uh, this one. Come on, Duncan. Welcome back. <laughs> Let's go back to fighting. These little green things. The demigorgons. Ow. Run away. Ah, face plant. Oh, I got one of them. There we go. Let's heal. Let's heal and let's pick up this med pack. Trident of Morda is awesome, but too short. Oh, interesting. Okay. Have we been this way yet? Where does this take us? Secrets. Oh, we got this already. We did this. <laughs> it all starts to look the same. Oh, I came up here and then I said, no, there's too many enemies. Ooh, that was cool. I killed one and it blew up the others. Oops. Oh, oh. 
No, I'm trying to dash away, but it's dashing me over the ledge. Children of Mortis, 20 hours? Oh. That's not short at all, yeah. I mean, too short if you love it and you're like, oh, it was over too soon. Yeah, I get that. And here's a core. Three. Three down. We can open that door now. It's an amazing story. It's so wholesome. You have to level up and all that takes a while, but if you know everything, it's just eight levels. But that could be a different amount of time for different people. Open the door. Don't follow me down here. What are you doing? Did we finish all this, uh, is this area? I think so. can't dash through you. Ugh. Ah. I swear I pressed the right button. I promise you. <laughs> I retract my statement. It just depends. But yeah, I mean, I'm not trying to argue with you that it's like a short or a long game either way. I've not played it. I would not know. I didn't even need to go down there. All I want to do is go to the dang elevator. This. But these enemies keep coming back. It's rude. Oh, wait, we cleared this and now I immediately have to do it again. Oh well. They hit with such force. Nope, I miss. Oh, but I have my cool new projectile thing. Oh yeah! I shot it into the water. Thing I loved about Morta. Oh, this is a creepy room. As you find a new member of the family and you think, wow, they're amazing, and then you get the next member and they're awesome. Repeat several times. That's great. And there's Lily who wrecks everything. This is easy mode. This is newcomer mode. And it's not that different, but I get way more frequent health drops. Like right now I have three health packs. When I played this the first time on standard, I would have had zero health packs this whole time being like, when am I going to find another one? So it's nice having the safety, the relaxation of like, okay, if I need to heal, I can. <laughs> Dog. Money. How do I get up there? I don't. Oh. Pink Knight. 
It's the pink Power Ranger. Are you going to have that same vision? You're going to show me some more cores that I already found. Look at these bugs. Ugh. How do we know which way to go next? Just go, we have to do both. Ooh, fancy. Oh, one of these. I don't know what it does. I've been taking screenshots of these, but I don't know what they are. I'm curious to see if you'll be able to understand the story in the end, because I didn't. I don't know, it's hard. It, I feel like it'll be like, um, Hollow Knight or Axiom Verge. Axiom Verge I had to play a couple times. To beat a couple times to get a better understanding on how I felt the story ended. But I don't think I've actually ever watched a lore video on it. Hollow Knight, I had to watch the famous Moss, who is it? The moss guy that does the lore explanation video that's so thorough. And I really didn't know what was going on. I, I knew bits and pieces of Hollow Knight as I was playing it, but not to the full extent. Oh, what's this? I can open this too, because we have three cores <gasps> and a warp pad. Yay! And... I don't know if I needed a certain number of keys to open this or what. Oh. There's too much to do. This looks like a, an abandoned lab or something. Creepy. New enemies, little slime slugs. How do I get stuff like this? I can shoot it, but I can't go pick it up. Oh no! We did it! Secrets? Anybody got any secrets? Whoa. Neat. over this what oh I don't have enough keys take a screenshot now I can get this thing that was so cool
I have to clear this again? Ow, stop it. Can I go down from here as well? Doesn't seem like it. Can I go diagonal? No. What's this? This is not closed. <laughs> Just gotta walk around, I guess. Are we done in here? Was there something south? Hi, bees. How are you? Welcome in. Happy Saturday. There is stuff south. There's too many paths. More combat music. Oops, ow. Uh. Oh, I sh fired the bomb the wrong way. Oh well. We still finished the room and got a coin. And a key! Need to find more of those. Hi Moko, welcome in. This is Hyperlight Drifter. This is a cool symbol on this block here. I don't know if it means something. It reminds me of Celeste. Can I not go this way? Doesn't seem like it. Alright. Oh, it, oops. Is it this way? Yeah. All these secret hidden moving platforms everywhere. Now I understand a little bit. You can you can step close to these, like on the edge, and it takes a second for them to kick in. That's helpful. Is there something down here that you're blocking? Nope, just fire death. Ooh, I only have one health pack right now. I'm gonna use it. Oh, weird. Can I say something about the orange costume you got? Yeah, that's fine. I was asking about it earlier. Um, oh, I was asking about the bot. Does the orange, do the different costumes have different powers? I was wondering if that was the case, maybe. Ow. Stop lighting me on fire. It's rude. How do I get up there? Weird. up there. They have powers, but it's never explained what each costume does, so if you ever want to know... I can ask you. 
is there a place in game to to find it or they just straight up don't tell you ow Oh, that blocks off that entire platform. Okay, interesting. I don't think they ever tell you unless you somehow notice by yourself. Hmm. I don't know if I would ever notice. All right, I don't know how to get over there. Let's go back. Sad days. What is this? Humans. There's Garrett, so many. hi, welcome in. Are they friendly, Kara? No, streaming every Saturday official. Mm. <laughs> we'll see. We were doing, um, we were chatting earlier. It's been a, a stream of many topics. I'm getting ready to potentially either go back to nail school if they decide I need more hours supplemental or s go back into being a nail tech, try to get certified. So depending on what kind of schedule I'm on for that will determine Saturday stream potential in the future. But that's, that's a little ways off still, no worries. It's a very pretty game. The music is by the same people who did the music for Fez, Disaster Piece. Really cool environment, storytelling, ambience, beautiful pixel art. The bot has the same effect as the sword cloak. It doesn't matter which of them you equip, but I'll stop with it now. Okay, thank you, Angel Lord. I think I'm think I'm good for it to be a mystery for a little longer, um, and see if I notice. Because maybe I will, but I don't know. Who can say? The Fezness. <laughs> Fez is so good. I listen to that soundtrack all the time. I feel like there's something down here. Nope. Let's heal. Now we have a shortage of health packs. We were doing so well until this point. What's that pink laser down there? You see that? Who are you? <gasps> Frog with a backpack, be my friend. Oh, you're my enemy. You're shooting jelly at me. And I killed you with a bomb. Are we done? Is that the end of this room? I wish it was my friend. It was kind of cute. Shout out for indie game composers. Fez, Tunic, Outer Wilds, Bastion. So many. Axiom Verge! My soundtracks that are on repeat. Also, this game reminds me a lot of Tunic in some ways. Um, for people who are asking what this is similar to, for things I've played, I feel like it, it reminds me of Tunic. But I like the combat slightly better and... Oh, this wraps around, okay. What else? I'm getting used to it more quickly. Oh, and I like the easy mode better. I played Tunic on the invincible mode. Because it didn't have a mode between normal and invincible. Is there some switch that I can't find? Also. Speaking of soundtrack, this is really picking up. More frogs. The frogs are the ones that killed the otters, though. So they're kind of evil in that sense. We like the otters. 
they don't try to attack us. There's something over here? Where am I? Where am I? <laughs> I don't think I can get over there. It reminds me of Tunic and the amount of times you can just walk off screen. I'm gonna get food and avoid spoilers, but glad to hear you're enjoying this. Absolutely enjoy food. Thanks again for the raid. Uh, have a great weekend. Rest of your weekend. This is a cool one. Definitely avoid spoilers if you can. Although- Whoa, they can come out of the water? I feel like it's a little hard to spoil because it's so dang cryptic. But... First impressions are really important. Oh, heal. Scary ninja frogs. So many enemies! It's like following that shuriken across the screen. No! All of you are shooting at me over here with your guns! A health pack would be really nice right now. going on fully. Oh, there is one over here. Oh, I didn't get in time. We're gonna have to sprint to that corner of the room to get it so I can use it. That's so frustrating. The very first impression is most important when eating chocolate. When it's me mediocre chocolate, I eat the whole thing anyway. <laughs> you can't go wrong. Thank you for the follow. I appreciate it. Thanks for supporting a fellow human. We go down that way? No. Oh, this area is tough. Where'd that other frog go? Did I get it? I don't know. Well, thank you for the support regardless if you are not. <laughs> I feel like I've been saying that less lately, and then the time I bring it back, it's like, what if I'm not human? Okay. Thank you. I'm just trying to be nice. <laughs> it's just part of the shtick, because, you know, Jen the human. Oh, there's one over here. Nice. Any white chocolate enjoyers? Yeah, white chocolate's okay. Hi, Macchiato. Welcome in. Is this a secret over here? I don't think so. I'm stressed. I'm stressed. Thanks for the human hello. There are many. I'm not picky if it's good, it's good, and it doesn't have to be expensive. White chocolate's the only chocolate I dislike. It looks like I could fall down here. Oh! <gasps> I can, but I didn't actually want to. <laughs> Waste of a health pack. It just looked like there was a platform or something. Alright, not this room again. Immediately go over here. Nope. Bad move, because they follow me over there. Oh, 
The bomb button is so hard for re me to remember. I end up pressing B, which doesn't attack. It switches your gun. Man. Oh. There's another one that's gonna jump out of the water. Gotcha. I'm hiding in this corner. I don't know if my new dash protection works against these shurikens. I know it works against the bullets. Oh, dash out. Oh, God. No. No. Also, sometimes your character. Oh, my God. I just ran right through the fire. The pixel art, I don't know if it's the zoom out or what it is. I feel like I'm so undetailed that I can't tell if I'm facing up, down, left, or right. And that's important when you have to know which way to slash. So that's infuriating. Do I have a health pack? Yes. Mint chocolate is delicious. I agree. Coffee chocolate, also delicious. Like mocha ice cream, so good. Ooh, can I kite some of these guys out here? Nope. Mm. How come my bullet shield didn't work? Oh, this is stupid. Too many of you. Unnecessary. We gotta heal out of it. I can't tell what's going on! Dash right into the shuriken. Bot, stop telling me to heal when I don't have a health pack. Ugh. Terrible. Cool music, though. Oh, that's four. We're gonna have a flashback. Maybe? Yep. What's happening? Ow, ow. Light. It's so intense. Now there are these little, little lizards, little black lizards with pink eyes, and then they evaporated. Scary. But we got the core, but we need to heal. The music's gone. There's like two goals in this game. One of them is fight the bosses. One of them is get the cores. Is the redemption price reduced? It's reduced. I talked about it in another stream. I should make an announcement in the Discord. It's reduced because it's a stream break, chats, stretch. Maybe dance break, not always dance break, because I don't always feel like dancing. <laughs> if you want, we can do it, or I can refund it for another time, if you want the dance time. I know. But we can definitely take a quick chat break. Um, 
Let's try to find a place to heal really quick. I save up for dance. I know, Macchiato. I moved some channel point things around because I thought some of them were too expensive, like that one for sure. And just want to keep it... I don't, channel points are so hard. You want to keep them fresh, but you want them to be things you're not afraid to redo and, you know, do all the time. I hope there's a health pack up here. No? Oh, look at this cool boat. Where are we on the map? The boss is over here. Oh. Oh. Scary enemy that could have killed me. Is this a health pack? No? Alright, we're gonna take a break anyway. I desperately need a health pack. Are these docks? Can I walk on these? Oh. At first, I thought it was a wall. Can I go on this boat? Healing! Yes! Just a day out on the water. Okay, here's a guess. But I don't know that I would have noticed it. Does the yellow cape and yellow bot make money appear, like, drop from enemies more frequently? Just a guess. Haven't seen anything to confirm or deny, but that's my guess. Because yellow. Because colors. Moko, have a good one. Enjoy cooking. That sounds really fun. We'll see ya. Can I make that jump? No. I'm so glad we found a health pack, though. This is something that looks like we'll have to... do later. Why? Look at these little... the tiny square markers. I feel like are associated with secrets. And this and this flower, what's up with that flower? Oh, can I shoot this? <gasps> A key. Have I muted the game? No. Can you not hear the game? There's no music in this part. There's there's only sound effects right now. And I have the sound effects really low, but the music a little bit higher. You're not missing out on much of the game right now. Okay, so cool. We did that. Maybe there'll be music on this screen. Yeah. Here's another secret. Another coin. We're making a fortune today. This reminds me so much of a specific area in Fez. What's up with this? Weird. Hmm. Okay. What are these barrels?
Oh, I don't think these pillars with the white squares on them, I don't think that's the same type of symbol. Whoa! Look at this titan in the water! The scale is so cool, how tiny we are, how big they make it look, cause like they have a way of showing the depth of the water. He's making a PogChamp face, totally. <laughs> That's impressive. Is there a way for me to get across? I don't know. I wish we could find a warp pad or something near here. Oh, enemies. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, I think I have to go this way. There's so many of you! another health pack. Yikes. There's money down here. Swarmed. The bomb was very helpful for that one. Did we get an autosave after that? I don't know if we did. Let's go this way. I'm hoping for another... Wait. Hoping for another warp pad? Did I just find one? Can't see. What's over here though? Oh, nice. I, don't, I still don't know what these do. Have a good one, Loki. Take care. We'll see you around. This all looks like secrets. We've been here before. This was locked and now it's not. We are on the warp pad screen, yay! Perfect. Okay, so next time remind me to go up here to the right through this door. Let's go back home because then I can warp back to this. Um, oh, weird. And we're going to play this again on Friday is the plan. I wonder if those totems are new items and things like that? I'm not sure. Did this mirror break? These are the same. This is all the same, okay. Alright, cool. We made it back home.
Uh, we'll start out next time with shopping for stuff and then we'll go back to that area. I like it. That was very fun. Thanks for watching Hyperlight Drifter and stay tuned for the next episode. Be sure to catch me live on Twitch for my latest playthrough. A huge shout out to our February Kofi supporters Oracle the Great, 8 Bit Trav, Toon Wolf, Semi Cortex, and Metal Spring Pro. Later, humans!